I got this rack on here and I'm not as unhappy with it as I thought I was going to be. At first, I couldn't get the bolts to fit down in the holes. They literally are machined so close that with the paint on them, down in place but I'm guessing they did that for a reason and the reason would be so that this thing stays pretty steady because as it closes it has to come over here and lock into this and you see that it's nice and neat there so it's got a couple of things going on here this pin right here you can pull out and put right there and that keeps this from coming open which Seems like it's like a double layer of protection in case that pin were to be loose. So, and then you can pull it out and put it here, and it keeps it from coming so far open that I guess if you had bicycles on here, your bicycle wouldn't wind up coming around and banging into your vehicle. That's what I'm guessing. And this part up here has got a little pin that you pop that. Take that out, scooch this up, put this pin back in, and that holds that up. And then you set your bicycles out here so that when your bikes are swung out, the whole idea of this thing is that you can have your bikes on there and get in and out of the back door of your little RAV4. And of course the RAV4 has that spare tire on it, so literally needs to have a goodly bit of it needs to be out there a ways to be good. And it is, I mean, you can load your vehicle like that and then close this door, swing everything back into place and you're good to go. Now, one of the things I was thinking I didn't like about this was they, instead of a pin in the trailer hitch, they have a bolt. And I was thinking, well, why in the world is threaded there? You could put a, th a pin through there, but I was thinking, why in the world would they do that? And I'm, I decided they did that to keep this from being so woggly. But in this case, see this two inch receiver is going into a one inch receiver and this is an adapter. So if this was a one inch receiver, I can see where that would steady it up. But because I have an adapter, I get the additional wobble from that little pin there. So I don't think it matters much, but there is that. So with this out here like this, you should be able to load your bikes right onto here. And then they got a whole bag of little strappy things over there to tie everything on there with. So I'm guessing that's the uh, that's how it works. Uh, like I say, if this pin here wasn't in, then this would come on around. But if you had a bicycle on there, your bicycle would wind up smashing into your vehicle there, and that probably wouldn't be good. So. So I'm going to leave it like that till I get a chance to show mechanics of it. Oh, there's one more thing here, and I guess this is a an additional lock. There's a threaded hole right there, so that like if you're traveling, you can lock that into place. That's a good thing. And then that way you don't have to worry about anything coming or coming loose and swinging around on you there. So, so that's how that works, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Uh, so there's that. Okay. I okay. mentioned the name of this too since I've shown you a little bit about it. This is called a sports rack. Yeah. Sports rack. Ridge swing four. Uh, yep. So I was getting ready to call them up. Well, I was. what I was getting ready to do was drill those holes out so those bolts would fit. And then call them up and fuss at them for making holes too small. But then I figured out, well, holes aren't really too small they're just the right size but they're just the right size which makes you it means you have to kind of go through a goodly bit of you know figuring to figure to get the bolt holes and everything to fit good but once you do it's all good so we'll call that all good oh i didn't show you these but these are the little tie up thingies there's a whole bag of these and i'm thinking well rather than having them flapping around back there i'll just leave them off when she gets ready she can hook them on and Hook her bike up with that. Oh, the joy. There's a mosquito out here. I wonder if he don't know he's not allowed. Mosquitoes aren't allowed on my property. You need to leave while you can. That's a pretty good banjo box. I'm going to save that.